Hello engineers, welcome to Five Mantra. Uh, let's uh, initially uh, appreciate Five Mantra for this initiative because uh, among all the competitive exams for engineers, GATE is considered to be the toughest one and uh, we take this initiative uh, to appreciate all the exams because once we reach, we try to reach this GATE, we will be reaching other exams also. So as a part of that, I will be my name is Ashok and I will be uh, teaching you mechanical engineering and in that particularly strength of materials I will be going to handle. Of this, initially let me explain uh, what all about the subjects in the gate for mechanical engineers. So this is common, that is general aptitude is common for every branch of uh, engineering as per uh, gate is concerned. So this uh, holds uh, about 15 percent, not about. So 15 marks is for this general aptitude. General aptitude consists of verbal ability and numerical ability. Okay. So this is essential part. That's why I've, uh, we must be prioritizing the study of this part of gate. Yeah. So this is the part of mechanical engineering. So if you could observe, this is segregated in different sections. Section 1, 2, 3, 4. Uh, if you closely observe the previous papers, so the weightage of the marks, so which is the smart way to uh, study, I mean prepare for the gate examination. So each section, the, if you consider previous pages, each section will be covered. No section will be left off. So if you want to uh, go ahead with uh, all the, means in the competition, so you have to be thorough with all these sections. Even if not, uh, you have to be uh, good, at, uh, good at each section of this mechanical engineering because it will not leave you throughout your uh, further studies and uh, whatever the competitive exams you are going to face in the future. So coming to the section 1, it is engineering mathematics. So whatever the part engineering mathematics you studied initially during the, your uh, course of uh, B.Tech. So it will be covered according to mechanical engineering syllabus. This part is essential, section 1. So which holds 15 marks, 13 to, in fact, 13 to 15 marks. Next section 2, section 3, section 4 completely core mechanical related sections. In this every way, uh, if you consider the weightage, so you need to at least study each subject from each section. Uh, we will be seeing in the further slides. So what will be the priority of study? Okay. So what are the sections here? Applied mechanics and design. Then fluid mechanics and thermal sensors which, which are interrelated as you all know. Then material science manufacturing and industrial engineering so you could see here so these are uh, three essential parts of this section 4 this is related to manufacturing this is related to engineering materials and these three related to industrial engineering so this is related to manufacturing okay so these three important essential parts of this and here if you see fluid mechanics is an exclusive one and heat transfer is some part of this fluid mechanics which we need to understand. These are all interrelated. Thermodynamics is the part which is vast and which holds very good weightage and which requires good revision also, thorough revision also. And coming to this section 2 again, so engineering mechanics, theory of machines, machine design, vibration, apart from this. I will be handling this uh, mechanics of materials and which also holds good weightage in this section, in this particular section. So that is up to you. So whether to, uh, means is always uh, now the time is less. So you need to be acting smart. So I prefer this mechanics of materials. Then um, further to discuss, so we will be seeing the priority in our next slide. So this could be the priority list based on uh, previous papers. Uh, we could analyze so what will be the weightage of uh, this each section I mean each subject based on that I have prioritized these things and if you see in this so only this first five parts will be holding around 50 to 60 marks 50 to 60 marks weightages from first five parts so try to understand what is the importance of uh, those topics so if you uh, study this uh, selectively and within this short period of time so it will be very appreciable, uh, you can score appreciable marks and uh, thereby you will uh, go ahead in competition.
okay although this uh, subjects preparation will never uh, go out of your mind because this preparation will be useful for other subjects also i mean other competitive exams also so coming to this particularly uh, these these can be interchangeable anyway mechanics of solid sometimes uh, if you are favorable with uh, your favorite subject is fluid mechanics you can go ahead with fluid mechanics also instead of mechanics of materials or also called as strength of materials and among this if you consider this manufacturing engineering so you should not uh, leave this engineering materials as a separate part of this manufacturing engineering it should be included because if you consider if you analyze the previous paper of 2019 so you got uh, complete uh, marks from engineering materials only so they have excluded uh, probably what whatever whatsoever may be the reason they have uh, excluded this manufacturing engineering and they have concentrated only on engineering materials so you should be including this engineering materials as a part of this manufacturing likewise you have to study so that it will have a good weightage of about uh, 18 plus marks about 18 plus marks including engineering materials if you see the center materials it will be around uh, and uh, particularly to speak in 2019 it has got 14 marks on an average but it will it may not be the case in every year but uh, if you see always some average if you take 7 to 9 marks is always a fixed value for this fixed uh, marks for strength of materials so this is a very good weightage when compared to these two subjects suppose if you want to study the strength of materials some part of will be some part of uh, engineering mechanics and machine design will also be covered in this as the fact uh, you know that so these two subjects some topics will be covered in this suppose uh, take an example of uh, uh, th theories of failure theories of failure will be studied here also and principal stresses principal stresses will be studied in strength of materials also those topics will be useful for machine design okay so i i suggest this uh, strength of materials before getting into this machine design and engineering mechanics because they have got uh, comparatively relatively less marks less weightage okay so this is uh, my analysis about uh, based on uh, previous papers so this is a priority uh, in our next video we'll be getting into the actual syllabus of strength of materials i'll be explaining you the syllabus then we'll be entering into each topic uh, since time is so short so we will be uh, having our videos concise videos so such that topics will be covered co concepts will be covered briefly uh, rather than uh, explaining them uh, making the lengthy videos and we will be concentrating more on solving the problems i hope this video will be uh, very much useful for you to get further updates please subscribe to the channel please like share and comment let us grow together thank you